Well, we just heard Tech Bytes talk about it. Fort Worth-based American Airlines jumping into supersonic air travel as the airline just placed a big bet that it could bring back the age of the Concorde. Remember that? Yes, I do, and I think a lot of other people do. Maybe not making them feel so great. That means flying from New York to London a little over three hours. Now, critics tell Morgan Young it won't do anything to solve the issues that we're seeing now the airlines are facing. Imagine getting from Miami to London in less than five hours from LA to Hawaii in less than three. Sounds fabulous, right? While American says in a few years, we won't have to imagine. Meet the refined design. It's been almost 20 years since passengers could fly at supersonic speeds. The Concorde was grounded in 2003 because it took too much gas, was high maintenance and cost way too much. There was also a high profile crash in 2000. A company called Boom Supersonic says its aircraft, Overture, is fast, safe, and sustainable. American announced it's paid a non-refundable deposit for 20 of them. But the Allied Pilots Association, which represents American's pilots, is not on board. Well, it sounds like a new shiny object that's years out, and we immediately thought, is management going to focus on solving the problems that American has today? Captain Dennis Tazer says they're more concerned about current operational issues, like a shortage of pilots and scheduling issues. You know, I've flown supersonic in the military, and it's amazing. But we got problems right now in our subsonic fleet. A CNN report lays out American cut 31,000 flights from its November schedule. This after chopping 2% of flights in September and October and canceling thousands this summer. The fall and winter schedule are so uncertain right now. And American is continuing to sell tickets that we're not sure they're going to be able to fulfill in a reliable way. He says pilots would like to not have to imagine a better work environment. As for the Overture, we've still got some time. Boom plans to roll them out in 2025 and start flying passengers in 2029. In DFW, I'm Morgan Young. 527 this morning.